Hello and welcome back to my channel. So, I have a new baby. If you saw my last video, I said that my due date was tomorrow, like as I was filming that video, and the baby is now here. She is now five days old, so I thought that I would do like a little small introductory video just letting you meet her. I am going to film a video next week as to what happened in my birth, my birth story, which was a very long story. So if you're interested in listening to that, then stay like subscribe to my channel because yeah, it's it was a long process. And if you're pregnant, I probably wouldn't watch it if I was you. Um, not that it's like really, really awful, but I didn't have the best experience, so yeah but basically the baby is here now anyway she is called bonnie esme power she's got jamie's last name and we decided to call her bonnie back in april when we was on holiday in mallorca we were thinking of names it was literally just after we found out that she was a girl i didn't like any girls names like i literally have like well, I had zero girls' names that I actually liked. Um, but then I thought of Bonnie and I was like, I actually kind of like that name. Jamie liked that name. So that's what we ended up going for. But we kept it in the back of our minds that we could still like change our minds at any point if we wanted to. Her middle name, Esme, just kind of like is a bit random as well. But Jamie sort of said, oh, what do you think to the name Esme like as a middle name? And I was like, yeah, I actually like that. So that's her middle name but when she was born she weighed eight pounds three ounces and since then she has gained weight um i'm not 100 percent sure how much the midwife came today and weighed her and said that she's gained weight since giving birth or well, since i gave birth which is obviously a good thing um so she's not like underweight or anything like that but i can't remember the exact number that she said so anyway i'll stop rambling and i will show you the baby Oh, and also, I am also going to be filming next week an experience, like my experience with pregnancy, what the first trimester, the second trimester and the third trimester was like, because all three trimesters were very different to each other and my kind of feelings and everything was very different. So I'm also going to be filming that next week as well along with my usual cleaning video hopefully. I have a lot more time at home now and a lot more free time because the baby does sleep a lot through the day so I am able to get a lot more stuff done and film more videos. But this is Bunny so she is currently asleep. I think she's kind of like stirring and waking up. Um, She is kind of getting ready for like another feed soon so that's probably why she's like slowly waking up. But yeah, she's got this little blanket on her that somebody I work with, she's called Christina, she knitted this for her. So cute. And this is what she sleeps with as well, um, kind of tucked in like this. Um, but she doesn't sleep in this crib at night. There is another one upstairs, but this is the one that she sleeps in down here. And yeah, it's so cute. It's The only problem with this is that it's not the most sturdy thing in the world. So um, I have to watch the dogs when they're running around and stuff, that they don't knock it or anything. <laughs> But yeah, Bunny is five days old now today and she's doing really, really well and she sleeps a lot, but she also likes to eat a lot. Well, drink a lot of milk. She drinks a lot of milk and I don't mean she drinks regularly. I mean that when like every few hours she will drink like a few ounces of milk and at the hospital they said she only needs like an ounce every hour every three hours or something and she drinks like three times that so I was not surprised when they weighed her and she was like like that she'd gained weight which is a good thing because some people's babies lose weight in the first week in fact it's quite common for that, that to happen she does sleep a lot through the day but at night she is a little bit more awake um which is okay um but it means that we end up getting up a lot in the night um but you know she's kind of leveling off i kind of get up once or twice which isn't too bad but when i say get up i mean it's like an hour and a half each time so that's three hours of the night gone but i know it's a lot worse for other people so that's absolutely fine this changing table was literally a godsend this was like oh sorry there's poo <laughs> this was like i can't remember it was really cheap it was like I don't know, 20 pounds or something off Amazon, but it is literally amazing. And you've got space for like all the nappies and stuff. And this is just great because it means I don't have to like put a mat on the floor or anything. I can just stand up and change her. Also got this like little play swing thing, which she sits in and it makes a lullaby noise. 
and it swings, um, which she quite likes as well, but she never sleeps in this. Like she just can't sleep in this. And I think my midwife said they can only stay in this for like 30 minutes anyway at a time. But this video is basically mainly just for you to kind of meet her. I will be filming a lot more vlogs of days out when we actually go out and do stuff with her. And and you'll see like more of that. Um, but yeah, it's just uh, welcome to like welcoming her to my channel and to everybody. Um, but yeah, I might insert a compilation now of some clips and videos that I've taken over the past kind of five day over the past five days of her and some pictures and things just so that I have them in here if you want to see them. Um, so yeah, I'll do a montage now. Well, at least if you need hospital treatment, I mean, it's right there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway.
Anyway, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I will be posting a lot more videos with Bonnie um, in the future and stick around for next week. I've got my birth story coming, uh, my experience with pregnancy in general, and also I think a cleaning video as well. A um, bit of a random mix, but I'll see if I have time for them. But I'm pretty sure I will because I literally have a lot of time in the day because she does sleep a lot in the day. And I try and keep really organised with her nappy changes and bottles being like ready to go when she needs them and stuff like that. So it just makes it easier for me to, you know, not have to rush around or anything like that. But that is everything for this video. I will see you in my next one. Goodbye.